Hi, I'm Arielle Feldman, and I've been working in Dr. Kamiri's lab for the last about two years. What we do here in Dr. Kamiri's lab, the real-time neural engineering lab, is we basically make devices that we put into the brain, and then we analyze the data that we collect from the brain in order to uncover new neuroscientific findings. We can print these very tiny things that, with such um, specificity that we can then use them to interface with the brain in ways that we haven't been able to before. One of my first projects here involved creating an elevator for rats, which I aptly named the Relevator. What we were trying to show with that was that cells can encode space in three dimensions, not just two dimensions. What I've been working on as of late is um, investigating this event that happens in the hippocampus called a sharp wave ripple. You can think of it as sort of you're replaying a memory or you're recalling a memory. If we can disrupt when this occurs, then we can prevent access to that memory. And someone with PTSD, if we are also able to decode what memories they're going to remember at a certain time and selectively disrupt before they can recall those, we can effectively block out those bad memories. What's been really interesting to me about working in the RNEL is how interdisciplinary everything is. Anything you want to discover in the brain or really in any other field, you need to have some familiarity with a host of other fields.